Welcome back, Ant Eaters. I can't believe it's already week two. Yeah, uh, the weeks go by so quickly with the quarter system. We're back here again to update you with all that's happening around campus. And I hope you're ready to hear all about these upcoming events. I know I'm ready. I'm Paxton Wright. And I'm Lori Sinanian. And you're, you're watching, watching ATV, ATV News. News. Two renowned New York Times journalists, Michelle Goldberg and Brett Stevens, will be on UCI's campus to guide a conversational debate on anti-Semitism and anti-Zionism. And this event will take place on October 23rd from 6.30 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. And it'll be in the main auditorium of the National Academies of Sciences and Engineering. Now, the event is free for everyone, but reservations are required beforehand. I love that our campus focuses on these important and sensitive topics that need to be addressed. I agree. Another event on campus that will continue from prior quarters from the Center for Student Wellness and Health Promotion is called Wednesday Wellness Walks, where it allows UCI students, faculty, and staff to participate on a guided walking tour. The walk includes two components. One is an educational component, and the other is a mindfulness component. Well, that sounds great, especially with how fast each quarter goes. I know I'm always looking for new ways to de-stress and decompress. Now, the guided walks happen on Wednesdays, specifically during weeks two, four, six, eight, and 10. Uh, so look out for week four's guided walk on October 23rd. Now all the walks will begin by meeting outside of Zot and Go at 11.30 a.m. and will conclude by 1 p.m. You don't need to register because it is free. Hey. Yeah. Now we'll have Natalie take it away with the entertainment segment. Hello Ant Eaters, welcome to the entertainment segment of ATV News for your number one source of all Ant Eater entertainment. There's been a lot of hype around the movie The Joker, starring Academy Award nominee Joaquin Phoenix. The movie is its own spinoff from the classic Batman movies we're used to seeing, and instead focuses on the life of the Joker and how he has become the living, the villain we all love to hate. If you're feeling in a lighter mood, but still spooky, The Addams Family comes back to the screen in cartoon. The cult classic is going to be in theaters this week, following the ventures of Wednesday, Pugsley, and their parents, Morticia and Gomez Adams. Since we're college students, AMC has $5 movies every Tuesday. Go get your spooky on. Now for some events happening on campus. Public conversations of poems and performance by Jane O'Newman, who tells the story, Refugee Tales. It is on October 24th at 5 p.m. happening at the Crystal Cove Auditorium. In the spirit of spooky season, go experience Reading Frankenstein, a performance about a scientist who discovers that her experiment is running around in her laboratory, right around the same time that the novel Frankenstein is out. Check it out through October 31st, going till November 9th, at the Experimental Media Performance Lab. If you're feeling in a more experimental mood, check out the East Meets West International Dance and Music Festival, the Barclay Theater celebrating global dance on October 22nd, 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. showtimes. Tickets are only $12 for UCI students. Hope you ant eaters are enjoying pumpkin spice lattes, candles, spooky movies, and pumpkin patches. Speaking on pumpkin patches, something entertaining you can do is take your friends, roomies, and significant other to Tanaka Farms Pumpkin Patch. Free parking on weekdays and free hay rides on the weekends, plus a whole lot more activities. It's not even a 10 minute drive from campus. Tis the season to be spooky. That is all for your weekly segment of ATV Entertainment. Stay classy, Ant Eaters. Now to Sports with Keely. Welcome back, Eater fans. I'm here with your weekly update on all things sports. On Wednesday, October 16th, our men's soccer team will be taking on UC Davis. The game will be at 7 p.m. over at Ant Eater Stadium. And then on Friday, October 18th, our women's soccer team will be taking on Cal State Fullerton. The game's also at Ant Eater Stadium, but this time at 6, so rally your friends and let's head on over. Well, that's all for sports for this week. Everyone knows ATV News is UCI's number one online news show. Well, it looks like that's all the time we have for today. Until next time. If you haven't already done so, make sure you click the thumbs up button to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more ATV content. And tap the notification bell right now. That way you get notified every time we post a new video so you can stay updated on everything UCI. I'm Natalia Viles. I'm Keely Blusmer. I'm Lori Sinanian. And I'm Paxton Wright. And this has been ATV News. Go, Go Ant Eaters! Eaters.